so far so good. Uh, we'll start by receiving your forms, and then we'll help us to Okay, fine. <coughs> we wanted this because our system is a bit slow. For this side, it's a big problem. It's easy for the law part for us, but we pray that we work in the team. We should also help us find the various agencies of government. Yeah, we have to. Yeah, we are running. Uh, they are supporters. You know, for you as a uh, party candidate, it's oh, very oh, easy. Yeah, okay. The system is tough. Oh. For the others, yes. Today is the last day. Thank you very much. You <laughs> <laughs> so, my pleasure to translate you from uh, an aspirant to a candidate. Yeah, thank, thank you very well. so much. Thank you very much. Yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> First of all, I want to thank uh, the people of Elgeo Maracuet County, whom I have served in the last 10 years as their senator, and uh, appreciate them for the support they've given me. It's been a very great pleasure for me to have worked for them for the last 10 years as their senator, doing representation, oversight, uh, legislation, and uh, above all, fighting for resources for this county. I believe that uh, I have discharged my responsibilities with utmost diligence and faithfulness to the duty given to me as, uh, as a senator. And I have uh, uh, conscientiously uh, served them in the Senate. And I believe that uh, my prayer for a renewal of uh, my mandate is coming up uh, before them on 9th of uh, August this year. I have confidence because of the relationship we've had with them. I'm very confident that uh, this application for renewal will be successful. I know that uh, the remaining um, days, uh, campaign days, will be uh, times, uh, uh, a time of review. And I believe that uh, a review of my responsibilities and the work I've done will uh, give me another opportunity to serve them. I want to request the people of Elgeo Maracuet County to uh, continue uh, uh, staying in peace, even though we are discussing uh, this in a very most, most difficult situation, that the lower part of the county, particularly in the Maracuet East and West, is undergoing very serious uh, acts of uh, violence, 
but I pray that our people will continue uh, 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 remaining calm and not revenging in that part of the county and the rest of the county for people to give maximum support to our residents uh, who are living in the in the Kerio Valley. I also want to say that uh, I want to wish all the candidates who have been cleared both for my position of Senate and the other positions, uh, the other remaining five positions, the presidency, the county governor, the county uh, MP, the women rep, for that matter, the MP and the MCA. I believe that uh, all of us have uh, a great opportunity to engage our residents and make our competition interesting and make it possible for the people to make a very informed choice. So I wish everybody, including my competitors, the very best. I believe that we will enjoy the journey that is ahead of us. It will be interesting. This is something we've done before. And uh, for those who are new to the race, uh, we promise that we will remain civilized in our discourse and make sure that uh, nobody will be a loser after the elections. For those of us who will win the seats, we will uh, be magnanimous enough. For those who will not, will have learned a lesson and will have informed uh, the leadership of this county. That is what I look forward to. I have told the IBC people, nimewambia kwamba ni jukumu pia ya IBC kusukuma serikali na idara za serikali idara usika ya serikali kutembelea bonde la ufa sehemu za Kerio Valley huko kuhakikisha kwamba wameleta amani. Ndio sisi wakati tunafanya kampeni watu wetu pia wakuwe na nafasi ya kukampeni. Uh, Kwa nimesikia viongozi kutoka county jirani. Uh, viongozi wangu wa county jirani Pokot na Baringo ningewaomba wasifanye matamshi ya ku uh, insight wananchi. Wasitumia matamshi ya kufanya wananchi wapigane. Sisi wote tukue uh, na heshima na wananchi wetu na tukue na heshima na maisha ya binadamu tuhakikishe kwamba amani Imepatikana ime, ime kule. So I really want to ask leaders from our neighboring counties, Baringo and uh, Elgio Maraquet County, to watch their utterances. I know a few of them have lost their course, particularly because uh, of political, uh, they, they are facing political extinction. And as a result, they are clutching on every straw to try to uh, force our communities to fight. I want to say that uh, as, a, as a leader in this region, no amount of, uh, of uh, pressure can uh, be pl placed on me or any leader for one to uh, shed blood for purposes of getting into political office. I want to urge our colleagues that they should not win by all means. They should not incite people to kill each other for purpose of getting political seats. These 69 days are very crucial because of uh, we are undergoing campaigns and elections. I want to request my colleagues to put aside uh, uh, their political positions and concentrate on ensuring separating between uh, fighting for political office and politics and, and uh, peace, politics and peace. And we must agree all of us in the three counties that peace is paramount and we must stick to ensuring that uh, our, our people are not incited and we are not inciting violence. And uh, er, every, anybody who is involving themselves in acts of violence or acts of incitement or uh, supporting or funding violence should be really very ashamed and the state must take very strong action to ensure that we live at peace in this career.